Mystics team will be gunning for a fourth straight conference title. Part of their recent success is sophomore Courtney McGregor, who's fresh off the Rio Olympics, where she competed for New Zealand. Next week, she will compete in her second major international competition of her career. This past year, McGregor was a first-team conference selection in vault and uneven bars. Add that to the experience in Rio, and McGregor can compete with the best of them. For her, though, she keeps the big stage simple in the back of her mind, knowing that she's already been at the height of her career, the Olympics. The last time I kind of learned how to deal with the nerves because it was a huge stage. So hopefully this time I'll be a little less nervous. You really just have to focus on what you're doing. Don't think about the results. Just think about um, your own routines and try and do those the best that you can. She will definitely be putting in the work for the World Championships, training 30 hours a week, which is 10 extra hours compared to her Boise State schedule. Amazed at you know finishing a 13 meet season, um, healing some of her bumps and bruises and coming right back in the gym and doing the volume of work um, with a smile on her face nearly every day um, and doing it, preparing the right way, I'm just, I'm amazed. McGregor also upped her skill set by getting the chance to train with Team USA's Simone Biles, who won four gold medals while they were both in Brazil. Can you imagine uh, someone getting a train with Michael Jordan? You know, she's, uh, Simone Biles was essentially the most successful female gymnast ever. Uh, both skill-wise and result-wise, and to step on the floor and be right next to that kind of greatness, I think it elevates your game. Absolutely amazing. They put in a lot of work, and especially Simone, just watching it in real life is phenomenal. <laughs> now, McGregor isn't holding out the chance of competing with New Zealand in the next Olympics. Sure. That will be in 2020 in Japan. Okay. And on the meantime, she's focusing on getting a four-peat MRGC title with Boise State. That beam is I know, I know it's, it's amazing athletes. Yeah. All right, yeah. thanks, Dan. Here's a live look.